morning guys it's lynn here and welcome to another plan with me it's a rewind one again as i always do with my erin condren and i thought i would just jump on really quick and just do an intro before we get into the plans um we are doing do, 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 the week of march 6th to 12th it was my first week back at work full time so i'm hella tired had a wedding this weekend on saturday um and sunday was also really busy so it's monday now the following week the 13th it's labor day here in melbourne awesome so i'm gonna get this done gonna clean and then cook then go back to sleep and then somehow fit in dinner after that so who knows um I am using a kit by Scribble Prince Co this week. It's a super old kit um, because I thought that the diamonds and colours would be fitting. A bit white. Hold on. Hmm. Let's do some adjustments here. There we go. That's a bit better. Um, fitting of the. Well, I guess similar to the colour themes, you know, diamonds and weddings. Um, so it's super pretty, super muted. I was going to do a no white space spread because I haven't done one of those in a while. But I'm thinking that I'm just going to do similar to what I did last week with um, scattering the full boxes around and yeah, whatnot. Because it kind of is like so busy that doesn't look like a white like a white space spread but it is but it's not a no white space anyways I've got the glitter headers pulled out I think I want to use a silver a blue and a kind of muted pinky purple um, these are from Frank Hearts U and I will get started I hope you guys enjoy um, if you haven't already, hit subscribe, leave a comment below, let me know what you want to see. I think I might do some Trouble and Notebooks um, videos coming up because they seem to be doing well and I'm needing to incorporate more fitness and food type stuff in there because it is a goal of mine now, a really important one to lose some weight. Even though I'm not that, you know, fat. Um, I have put on about 10% of my body weight, which is terrible. My feet are starting to hurt and my knees are flaring up and it could either be arthritis or I need to put on too much weight. I am hoping it's the latter because the first would be no bueno because I'm not even 30 yet. Anyways, enough of my rambling. I hope you guys enjoy and I'll chat to you all very soon. And I'm back. Um, so, I'm just gonna do a voiceover for the rest of this video. I'm going in with. No, I lie. I am not going in with the glitter headers first. I'm going in with the bottom washi, which is matte and super weird to use again, um, but was a lot easier to pull up. Um, moving on to the sidebar, I'm just popping down. Um, a piece of washi on top and the bottom of the quote box because I thought it'd be nice to kind of create a border for it uh, But I didn't really like the pattern washi so I removed that um, I don't really use the sidebar in these rewind spreads again Like I've said previously I need to work out what I actually want to use it for um, And you know work towards that <coughs> Excuse me but um, That extra washi there just takes up a bit more space uh, which is good for me um, so now I've laid down all the full boxes and I'm putting down all my glitter headers and the weekend banner I apologize in advance the lighting in this video is not so great it was changing a lot because um, I filmed this super early and the Sun was coming up and it was cloudy and you know all the good stuff you want to happen when it's um, when you're trying to film a video and also my hair my face comes into the frame a lot so i apologize for that again um yeah so i've got everything down in the spread and i had an extra full box left so i've just added that to the sidebar 
and I put down one of the weekly checklist um, underneath that for my dinners which I didn't really fill in um, and that's my sidebar complete so Monday I put down a fuck it's Monday sticker on top of a a piece of washi because that was the feels I was having on Monday and it was a super long day it's been a super long week um, this week uh, a lot of ups and downs good overall but crazy so that's why I had teeny there and she's going spazzo at the, her desk because um, that's what happened although I wasn't really at my desk because I was so busy uh underneath that i put down that harvey picked me up from work which is a blessing and then um i changed the sticker underneath that to a to-do checklist for the things i did for youtube that night and at the very bottom there i put down a meal little thing because harvey cooked me chicken and broccoli for dinner um Moving on to Tuesday, I went to Pilates in the morning, which I've been pretty good at doing this week, with the exception of one day, which I cancelled, but I anticipated that in advance, so it wasn't too, too bad. I'm um, at the bottom there, I'm just putting down that Harvey wasn't going to be home, and that I was publishing my personal plan with me on some little things, and there's my nose. Um, underneath the Pilates, I put down a half box, because... We found a happy hour place. We went and got some um, cocktails after work. It was 10 bucks, five to seven, and it's super bad because it's in a really convenient position and terrible. So I had an espresso martini and then went home to kind of do some cleaning and tidying. And you'll see here on Wednesday morning that I could not sleep from the espresso martini. So. Wednesday was a terrible, terrible, terrible day for me. Um, I still managed to get up and do my Pilates, so go me. And I did groceries later that night. This isn't in chronological order, unfortunately. I just had no space at the bottom. Um, but I had a terrible day at work, so I put down a crying munchkin because that's exactly what happened. Um, had a moment. But thankfully, I don't think many people saw, so I just wanted to put that down. And then after that, I went and got wine again at the same place because it was $5 for the glass. And it was really delicious. And it was the first glass of red wine I've ever had. I feel like an adult. Um, but yeah, I came home. Um, I had a glass of wine with a friend and we were just talking shit, really. And yeah, Harvey had dinner for me when I got home and I went to bed early and... Thursday was a much better day, although there was a lot of meetings, um, which is the story of my life in this new team. Uh, so I've just popped that down, and then after work, Harves and I went to Fonda, which is a Mexican place, which Harvey has been loving, and I had to do some shopping just for, you know, wedding cards and just a bit of makeup, bits and bobs. Um, moving on to Friday, I had Pilates again in the morning and then at lunchtime I had boxing which was a lot, a lot of fun but I am so unfit so I need to really up my game on that front as I said at the start of this plan with me, I need to really focus on my fitness. Um, I ended up having a super late lunch because I had more meetings but then it was beer o'clock and the day was over. But not really over because I had to go home and, you know, clean myself up and tidy because we had an inspection again on Saturday. So I'm just popping down that I tidied again. And then I had another inspection, which is a pain in my butt. Please, you know, hope that I get this over and done with soon so I can move on with life. But yeah, Saturday was my friend's wedding. It was out near Dalesford so I had to road trip out there it was about an hour's drive I wasn't happy how I marked the wedding but I didn't really have wedding stickers so I'm happy with it nonetheless and it was at a beautiful 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 ceremony the party was great it was excellent just chill very simple um, very beautiful and a whole lot of fun with the guys so we did a lot of dancing and I slept in the next morning but not too late because I was meeting up with some friends from Sydney 
Um, we went out to lunch. We were going to go to the donut festival, but I had to get home and I was just so tired. We went to Moomba, which I don't really know what Moomba is, but it's a big kind of carnival um, held in the city here in Melbourne. And I just put down this Fox and Cactus sticker because that's how I felt. Um, I was just so tired. I went. I was going to cook, but mum and dad ended up making the meal I wanted. Um, but then I had to meal prep for the week and I made meatballs, which took forever, but is delish. And then while I was doing all that, I watched the Vampire Diaries finale, which I can't believe it's over. And I don't know how I feel. I don't really care because I was just watching it for amusement more than anything else. And now, as you can see, I'm going in with the deco and that's pretty much the end of this plan with me. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will chat to you all very soon. Have a good week. Goodbye.